Hey everyone, I hope you all are doing well and staying healthy. Today I am sitting down to share with you what's in my toddler's Easter basket. He just turned two, he loves being outside blowing bubbles and painting, he loves cars and trucks, so I took all of that into consideration and purchased some items that I thought he would really love and enjoy playing with. Here is a quick overview look at his Easter basket. I think it came out super cute. If you are shopping for anything online, especially your kids' Easter goodies, make sure to do it through Rakuten, which is formerly known as Ebates. This is not sponsored in any way. It's just a website that I use and love and I think you guys would really benefit from using it as well. It is a website that you join completely free of charge. You shop through the website and you earn cash back on your online purchases. So let's say you want to shop at Target. Most of these items are from Target. You would go to the link in my description box below, create an account, again, completely free of charge. You would type in Target in the search, go to Target, hit get cash back. It'll take you right to the Target website. You shop like normal. Normal. you don't have to do anything extra and you will get cash back for your purchase if you sign up using my link you will get ten dollars cash back on your first purchase of twenty five dollars or more through the website it's an amazing website and anything helps right now any little bit of cash back helps I have earned over $800 on the website. It is not fake or phony. I have received multiple checks from them. They're amazing. Um, I will leave my link in the description box below. So with all that being said, let's get into what is in my son's Easter basket. The first thing is a monster truck because like I said, he loves trucks and cars. So I found this one at Target. This is the Monster Jam truck. This is the Earth Shaker. They have multiple different kinds, um, like Grave Digger and Zombie and your, you know, normal monster trucks. I picked this one because it's a combination of a dump truck and a monster truck, and I just thought that was cool. Seems like something Bubba would enjoy. There's a little figurine in there as well. So I picked that up for a couple bucks at Target. Like I mentioned earlier, he loves to paint, so I found this in the Target dollar spot. It's just two little wooden um, figurines. There's an Easter bunny and a carrot, and there's a little thing of paint and a paintbrush, and I'm gonna take this outside with all my extra paints, let him go to town, and then I'll put his name and the date on the back and use it for Easter decor in the future. So two birds, one stone. I thought this was adorable. I also got him a little chocolate bunny because no Easter basket is complete without a chocolate bunny. This one I wanna say was a dollar from Target. This is just the Russell Stover milk chocolate bunny. I like that it's nice and small. I'll just break off little pieces here and there and give this to Bubba over time. I picked him up a board book. We still love board books here in our house. This is the story of Easter. I really wanted to get Bubba a book that explained the actual story of Easter and why we celebrate. We are Christian and it is important to us to celebrate more than just the Easter bunny and Easter baskets. I wanted him to know the real reason and I read through this book and thought that it did a really great job of explaining it for um, a child of his age. So uh, I think this is a really great one. I will link it like I mentioned. This says it was $6.99 in the back, but but I know I paid less than that because it was on sale. So I got that for him. This next thing was actually from TJ Maxx. I went in there well before this virus started happening and just did some shopping and I found this and thought it'd be great for his Easter basket. It was $3.99. It is just the Melissa and Doug on the go vehicle water reveal pad. So basically this is just um, a water marker and you paint the pages and the color comes to life without there being any mess or crayons or markers on any of your surfaces at home and like I said he loves trucks and cars and all this so I thought that he would really enjoy this and then I believe this dries and you can reuse it lots of times so he'll get to play with this and then this might be something I throw in the diaper bag and take with us to restaurants and things like that in the future just to keep him entertained so I thought that was fun they had lots of different um, kinds to choose from they had princesses and all kinds of stuff like that I also got him this Hot Wheels set. There are one, two, three, four, five cars in here. These are the four by fours and trucks ready to work or race. Um, there's a 52 Chevy, a Sand Blaster, a Datsun 620, a 2009 Ford F-150, and a 68 El Camino because you guys are really interested. Um, so this was really inexpensive as well. He is constantly carrying a Hot Wheels car around. So I thought I would get him a few more and I think he'll really, really love this. And then last but not least, this is actually supposed to go into his Christmas stocking. I purchased it at the end of summer last year and then hit it apparently really well because I just found it in the closet. Um, this is just a big bubble 
little wand. I want to say it was on clearance for 50 cents. So I've had this for a while and we will take this outside and blow lots of bubbles. So that is everything that is in his Easter basket. I think it's all things that he will really love. No crazy excess, small items that I don't have to find a lot of room for, which is something that I'm thankful for because Anytime there's a holiday or a birthday, there's just like stuff exploding in my house. So I kept it very simple, minimal, and items that I really knew he would love and enjoy. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Let me know what the Easter Bunny is bringing your kids this year in the comment section below. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, make sure to do so so that you don't miss out on future videos. You can also find me on Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, Facebook. All of that will be linked in the description box below. Thank you for watching, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye everyone.